This is what we're dealing with. This is what we gonna deal with. This is what we gonna deal with. <laughs> hey guys, what is up? Welcome back to my channel. Welcome back to the channel. I am Deborah, the owner, yeah. <laughs> so we have a couple of things. First things first. How do you guys like my braids? My daughter did them and they're really cute. I'm gonna have to take them out today though because I need to take a shower. Um, and they're just like not tight enough. I need them a little bit tighter. But yeah, this is what we're this is what we're working with today. <laughs> so yeah, no no judgy comments about my do. Please, please. Have some respect on me. Okay, anyways, I'm being weirdo. First things first. We're gonna be doing a couple of unboxings because ain't nobody got a time for doing it any other time but now. The weekend before Xmas. X miss. I don't know. I don't know what I'm doing. Is what my psychologist told me. I am going to go ahead and open my little Ipsy bags that I got. I did purchase one um, when they were having like this sale thing or something like that. Like where you can repurchase bags that you might be interested in and might have like the items you want or whatever. So I went ahead and did that. So this is obviously like you saw an Ipsy video. So yeah, go ahead and stick around. And if you guys do like any kind of beauty driven content, then I am your gal. I'm your gal. Go ahead and subscribe and make sure you hit the notification bell because I do post whenever the hell I want. So if you want to check out my videos and see when I post, go ahead and hit that bell. Um, let's get started. Here we go. I think I opened this one because I got this second one like a couple days later and I was like, what the hell is that? I don't, why do I have like two bags? It was so weird. So, um, yeah, I had to peek in it and I was like, oh, now I remember. Because, you know, Ipsy takes so damn long to ship anything. So we'll go ahead and open the first bag first. First bag first. And that's why I don't have any makeup on or anything. Hopefully I can get like a cleanser and kind of like a full face, like a semi full face out of these two bags. Fingers crossed. So I got something out of my bag. That's everything. So. Ipsy is a $12, $12 a month subscription and they have three different tiers. I don't know how much the other ones are because I don't get them. Um, so the first one is $12. That's the one. Those two are what we're going to be opening today are the $12 a month ones. So yeah, if you guys want to sign up and you guys are interested, uh, you get, I think, four, five, four or five um, travel size to full size products in each bag, which is really nice. It's really cute. It's something. It's something, you know. So yeah, I'll have my link down below. I just get like points or something. I don't, I'm not affiliated with them or anything. So yeah, it's just a reward program like any other one. <laughs> um, so yeah, I really, really appreciate it. If you guys do uh, click that if you want to join this action. Okay, first things first, I did get this little cute brush. This is like a little shader brush. Um, I'll probably give this to my daughter. Because, I mean, how many shader brushes do you really need, you know? And I've already got, like, four, probably, four different kind, big ones, little ones, fluffy ones, flat ones, you know? So, yeah, I don't need this. It is a really cute brush, though. It's thin. It's all matte black. So, I really do like the aesthetic of the brush. And these Firma brushes are actually pretty decent. They're pretty freaking soft. So, I do like them. So, let's move on to the bag. Look at how cute. This bag is so effing cute. I freaking love this material right here. I love it in blue maroon and this emerald green. It's my favorite. So, this was a really good choice for December. So, that's what it looks like. The whole back side is, is all fuzzy. And then the front side is half and half. In a diagonal... And then it has a little ipsy gold thing right there. I'm sure it's real gold too. I'm sure. 
Okay, let's take out the card. I don't remember what I picked for this month because it was so damn long ago. But, oh man, I think my card sandwiched. I actually put my card in and then it got sandwiched in. The first thing I see here is by Pacifica Wild Hemp. Wild Hemp. Hemp infused eyeshadow. Okay, I don't think we need that, but, you know, let's see. Not that I'm against marijuana or anything to each his own, as long as you're, you know, of age, it's fine. Um, if that's what you want to do. So that's what it looks like right there. Really cute packaging. It's all purple and like very like foresty, floral. I, it looks cute. I love the style of it. So you get 3.6 grams. So it's just a little, a little, little guy. I hope I got some chapstick in here because I really, my lips are a little bit dry. Okay, after 20 years, this is what it looks like. That is so, that is so stinking cute. How freaking adorbs is this? I mean, it's very, you know, but it's drugstore, it's a drugstore product, so. Oh, oh, check it out. <laughs> That's so funny. So these colors look really nice. This one at the end, it's got this blue kind of sparkles in it. It looks really pretty. I'm not going to swatch this though because I have a lot of eyeshadows and I don't, please. I don't really like drugstore eyeshadows. Like, I, I just don't. So, um, I'm going to pass this on to my daughter. That's what I'm going to do. I am going to wrap it up. And that's the good thing about these boxes is that if there's something in there that you don't like, hey, it's like Christmas time, somebody's birthday time, that you know would enjoy that. Definitely wrap that up. Wrap a couple things up. You know, cute little things that you get from this and make it like a little package or something. Super cute. People love it. So... The next thing I'm pulling out is by Pure Elise. Let's see what this is. It is. It says Prevent uh, Blue Lotus Seed Mud Mask and Exfoliant. Gently resurfaces, detoxifies, brightens, tightens, and smooths 10-minute facial. All skin types sensitive. Okay. Uh, you get a half an ounce in this one, so that is really good. Um, you could probably use this a couple times, I would think. Hmm, why not? The next thing is by Yensa, I think it is, Yensa. Color Plus Face Tone Up Primer Essential Glow. Eight Super, super, eight super Blacks Essence. I can't read. Um, this says the Superfood Cosmetics moisturizer and, moisturizes and preps skin for makeup, blurs in, imperfections and pores, provides brightener, brighter skin tone, powered by eight super blacks essence. Super black, I don't know what super blacks is. I've never heard that. The ritual smooth, the ritual, a smooth thin layer of tone up primer over clean moisturized skin. Blend BC foundation for smooth, even coverage. Live your yen. Okay, that's why it's called yen, so. Nice, I did not know that. So there you have it there. We've got a little primer, so we can definitely use that today. I've got two more items left. So we did get one full size item so far. Well, I guess, I think this is full size, right? Yeah, shouldn't say it's not. Um, the next thing we have is by Neogen Dermology. So that's what that looks like. It's really cute. It's a, it's a small 15 mils, half an ounce. A clear soothing foam cleanser intensive blemish care okay I can definitely use that right now because I didn't clean my skin yet I haven't washed my face yet so that's good the last thing is something I've gotten before and I'm not sure if this is exactly the same one but I know I've gotten this before so it is this little trash perfume I am trash and it says, Eau de Parfum, natural spray, made in France. Um, yeah, basically they're saying that they take like trash stuff and kind of clean it, I guess, and just make perfumes out of it, if I'm not mistaken. 
It says beauty will save us from waste. A fragrant resurrection with upcycled ingredients. The first modern perfume of 21st century. There are treasures in the trash and we have found them for you. Reduce, reuse, recycle, and sniff. The most wanted scent made from the unwanted. So it doesn't really say what kind of, oh yeah, it does. Notes, bitter orange upcycling, apple upcycling, rose upcy upcycling, cedarwood, and gar gar garwita. So this is what it looks like. It's a pretty good size. It's bigger than those those little small ones they give you like as testers at Macy's or something. Let me spray. I'm going to spray it on this. I'm pretty sure I've had this one already. Yeah, it's it's very much, um, I don't want to be rude, but it's, it's kind of a boring scent. It's like, bleh, it's okay. Like, it smells like shampoo to me, honestly. Like a shampoo. That's what it smells like. It doesn't smell horrible, but it's not something that I would, you know, particularly look to go spray myself, you know? So, there we go. This is all we got right here, girls. Let me get all my shit. So this is everything. We got the eyeshadow palette, the cleanser, the primer, the brush, the mask, and the perfume. So that was an overall pretty nicely balanced um, bag, I thought. You know, it wasn't anything that was like, oh my god, I'm so excited to get that. Yeah. Yeah, there, there really wasn't. I'm being honest. And if you don't like honesty, this this isn't the channel for you. Okay, this is my next one here. I don't remember ever getting like a bag like this. I don't remember. I wonder if this is December. Hmm. I don't remember which one I purchased now, but this is cute. It's like a little sheep. It looks like a little sheep, sheep vibes here. Um, and it's a wristlet. Look at that. That's different. It's a little wristlet actually. That's cute for winter though. That is cute for winter. Hmm. Okay. Adorbs. It says Ipsy on here. So, you know, if you want to rock Ipsy. What is the deal here? I have something on my nail. These are my Christmas nails. Actually, I'll probably change them before Christmas, honestly. But, yeah. Look at my thumb. It's so cute. Okay, anyways. There was something out of my bag. So, this is it. I think, actually, I'm going to have to look because I don't think that is a December bag. I think this is the December bag. I haven't looked at any spoilers because I just don't like to, um, but I'm thinking I picked this. I wouldn't pick anything from that other bag, so I think I picked this if I'm not mistaken. Or maybe it was one of my choices and I picked something else hoping that I would get this anyways. And I did. So that is really cool. I love when they're tapered like that. This is called Tapered Highlight. I don't know. Oh, it says Beam Gaseous. Gash, gashy. I don't know. There's like sticky stuff on me. Okay. Let's see. Okay. Just like the slightest bit of poke. But that's, that's really cute. I really like this. I can use that for like like a more precise um, application of blush or something. Let's see if I got a cord. Oh, I did. I did get a card. Okay. This shall tell us more. <laughs> um, ho me. <laughs> home. Okay, for the holiday. Home for the holidays. It's where the heart and fun is. Rock those festive playlists. Done a red lip. Indulge in what you love and who you love. It's what the holidays are all about. Peace and love, peace and love. So, very cool. Oh, I won't go into that, but let's see what we got. Uh, the first thing I have right here is by Grace and Stella. It says, do your skin a favor. Use me. Lavender, I need one for my, for my purse, so. Actually, I will open this because... This would be nice to put on during the winter. And my skin, look at my skin, it's like so dry. I just came back from from um, Nevada and Utah and it was 
I mean, Colorado is pretty dry right now, but that is like so freaking dry. It's, it's a different level. That's nice. It has a very light, super light. My son's playing Xbox, so he's screaming. So it's, it's a very super duper light scent. It seems that it absorbs very nicely and quickly and doesn't leave like a greasy film behind. So that's good. That'll be good for my purse. It Cosmetics, a little um, Bye Bye Pores pressed, airbrush finished press, pressed powder. Okay, I can definitely use this today. Bye Bye Pores. I don't really like to use powders in winter, but I do like to, you know, dust, kind of do a setting, I guess, a little dusting. Okay, that's what it looks like there. Hopefully, this is this shade is like universal or translucent. Okay. It doesn't look like you, you know, necessarily see it, but I did put it right here. So, okay. Next item. Ooh, is in this pretty little box right here. Violet Voss. I do like Violet Voss. Those are a little bit more, these are a little bit more like, like you need to really work with them. Um, not really work with them. What is the word I'm trying to say? I guess less pigmented, I guess. Not that they're hard to work with, just like a little bit less pigment. So, um, but I do like Violet Voss. I do like them. And you get a lot of eyeshadows for a good deal. Violet Boss Eyeshadow Single. So this is a really cute packaging, just for one little single. It says pretty in pink. Ooh. Oh, it comes with the teeny's little mirror. That is so pretty. Oh. Come on up. <laughs> Look at how beautiful. Ooh, it feels really soft and like thick and like buttery. Wow, that's really pretty. I can use this as a highlight almost. It might be too maybe too light for a highlight, but look at that. You can really share it out. That's really pretty. Brooke USA. Be for real. And this is a lip balm and it's called Hannah. I love this color. That is so pretty. And I definitely am gonna try this on right now because I do need a lip balm. <laughs> oh my gosh, that's so cute got like a little horse or something. It's like a little horse head. That's adorbs. So this looks like a full size. I might be wrong, but you get a pretty decent amount of size of product. So let's check it out. Mmm. Ooh, it smells really good. Oh, it's kind of, let me do a swatch first. It's kind of a little bit kind of tug, tugging. So that's a really nice bomb. Okay. Yeah, you kind of have to really work it in there to get it. Ugh, it smells really good. It doesn't smell like cake batter or something. I don't know. I can't really, like a marshmallow. Like the way a marshmallow smells when you, when you um, pull it in half. That's what it smells like. Okay. So going through the prices, I guess, um, we did get a full size, two full size products in this one. This is the Tinted Lip Balm in Hannah. Um, and this bag is valued over $50. So that is really good. Um, so $14 for this. The deluxe sample is nine grams of product, but the full size, or the full size is nine grams for $30 for the pressed powder. And it's $30, and this one has 2.4 grams. So just divide that, and that's the price that you get. And I'll put that up here somewhere. Um, Grace and Stella Lavender Body is a um, deluxe sample, and the full, full size version is 470 mils, and it's $17. This one is 30 mils. So yeah, I'll have to do the math on that. Um, the Violet Boss Single Eyeshadow Pretty in Pink. Um, Full size eyeshadow palette is 12 grams, where this is 1.8 grams, so we do the math on that. And then the Bokashis, I don't know, 
um, Ipsy Exclusive Limited Edition Tapered Highlighter Brush. Um, and that is a full size at $15.95. So we got two full size items in this bag particularly. And overall, I mean, that's good. We got a lotion, lip balm, powder, eyeshadow, brush. So overall, that was a pretty good box or bag. So let me know you guys' thoughts down below. Did you like this bag? Which bag, like, did you prefer? Did you prefer, like, the kind of skincare stuff in this one with the perfume and brush, little brush? Or did you like this one um, with the brush and little, the little violet boss and press powder and all that stuff? Let me know down below. So, yeah, I hope you guys have a beautiful weekend. Hopefully I can get this up <laughs> um, today, which is Friday. Yeah, I know. It's Friday. <laughs> I think today is a week from Christmas, huh? I think so. So, yeah. I've just got to go run some errands like that. Really boring. I'm kind of really sleepy. Um, yeah. Thank you guys so much for watching. And if you want to stick, stick around um, to see me using these products on my face, go ahead and stick around. And if not, I really appreciate you guys for joining me. Don't forget to forget to hit subscribe and I love you so much. Okay. Be safe. Now that those bitches are gone, let's do this. <laughs> I'm just messing. All right. I'm going to quickly just put my face like a little bit of things on and then use um, some of these other items in here. So, you know what? It doesn't say. Yeah, I was going to say it doesn't say the one I picked but I think I did pick the brush. I wanna say, yeah, I wanna say I did pick the brush. I'm trying to build up my brush collection for my travel bag. I know, travel bag, right? It's like a freaking joke now. But um, I need to take these braids out, oh my gosh. I'll do it later. Maybe I'll just wear like a beanie or something today. Okay, I'm going to use the face wash, which is this little dude. Ooh, that's very pigmented right there. So this is what it looks like. I'm just going to use a little bit. It feels very whipped and looks a little bit shiny. Hold so I can try this and I must say this doesn't tickle my fancy because um, it has the weirdest smell it kind of smells like Noxzema if you guys ever has like Noxzema cream it's very inexpensive you can get like a huge jar for like a dollar <laughs> That's what it kind of reminds me of, and it doesn't have a very pleasant smell. It feels okay, too. It doesn't feel like... Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, no, honey. Girl. Mm -mm. No way. My face feels so flippin' tight right now. And, like, it feels like it... <laughs> It doesn't feel good at all. I do not like that whatsoever. <sighs> okay. I'm going to have to give this to my son or daughter. And they can use it. Their skin, of course, is going to be more tolerable to this. Um, it's not like stripping. It just feels like I, I just don't like when I, as soon as I rinsed it off, it had like a weird feeling on it. So, um, not like a tingling or anything like that, but just like, like, boom, everything was washed off. <laughs> I don't know. It was very, very weird. Uh, yeah. So I don't, I don't like that. Okay. This is nicely. I have to be honest too, now that this has been on my lips for a while, it looks cute and it like wears off, wears off really nicely. So I can definitely pop this off, pop this on in the morning. Right now I'm using my Glossier Cherry. 
I use that every single morning and I just put it over my lips before I take my kids to school. Because not only do my lips smell yummy when they give me kisses in the morning, but they look nice and healthy and red and don't make me look so sallow and dead. <laughs> that totally rhymed. And I swear, that's what I said. <laughs> so this is the texture and the, um, what is it called? Like the texture, I guess, of, of this. It's very whippy, very whipped, a very light mousse. That's what it is. It's like mousse. It's very moussey. So I've been having really skin, good skin, even though it's really dry and tight. I've been trying to combat that by just like putting oils and serums and, and balms and all that kind of stuff. But um, I've still been having pretty pretty good. That was like a little ingrown I had right there. It's totally gone. It just leaves a little red circle. And I don't know what this is actually because it's flat. It doesn't feel like anything. It doesn't look like a blackhead. So I'm not sure. But yeah. Overall, I'm having a pretty good, pretty good skin week. Okay, I really actually like that, and I don't know if it's like smoothing. I guess it kind of does. My pores look a little bit smoother. Yeah, I would say so. Who is really gonna make you pass out? Which scientifically, it has been proven that that's just not gonna happen, and that's why doctors in the OR and stuff like that spend, you know, ten, ten hours, eight hours with their masks on because there's, you know, they're doing surgery. So, and they don't pass out. Like, I mean, not only that, if you have a smartphone, it counts your CO2 level and go ahead, wear a mask, run around, do some activities with your mask on, count your CO2 again. And I promise you, it's not gonna be a scary level. So <laughs> instead of just like you being a sheep and listening to people just repeat the same thing because they're parrots, um, then you conduct your own research, not by going to TikTok, not by looking at conspiracy theory videos, not by looking at fake news. You actually do it, and if it doesn't work for you, then go get you a little medical pass. Because <laughs> it's so annoying. People constantly telling you that it's going to kill you or something. I guess doctors have had it all all along have had it wrong. Blush here. Okay, now I'm gonna try this powder. Oops, shit. I don't see like anything, you know, anything too out of this world for me right now, but you know, it's fine. I don't think it's terrible. All right, now I'm gonna get the little, this little guy right here. Use that out of my Always smells good. Mm -hmm. mm. Something, something smells good. I think it's my face. Hmm. Something smells really good. Um. So yeah, that's what that looks like. Let me go ahead and put this on my lid.
because why not be? I don't even think I'm going to wear mascara and just curl my eyelashes, which I don't have my eyelash curler because it's in my travel stuff. So I won't do that right now and probably not at all because I can't be bothered. So yeah, that is all we had. I don't want to try the eyeshadow palette like I said, I'm not going to put on the perfume, I'm not going to do the mask, and I already tried the lotion. So yeah, that is everything. Thank you guys so much for hanging out with me in this extended part of the video, and I really, really appreciate it. I hope you guys do subscribe and stick around for more videos. So bye!